All right. Oh, wait for it to load. Uh, trying to, okay, shake my head. All right, back in seven days, it is the blood moon. So we're gonna wait that out at the outpost. This is gonna be our new base. So we'll get to working on that after the blood moon. Hopefully we survive. Hello, how are you? Oh, chicken runs pretty fast. Oh, got spun there. I gotta be careful. <laughs> We're gonna have problems. My main plan is to kind of hold on the walls until they breach it, which last time that didn't take long at all. And then if I can, try to bail to the roof of the house. Destroy the climb up thing and hope they don't completely obliterate all my stuff before the end. But we'll see what happens. And if need be, I could just try to run to this thing and drive off until it ends. That's not very exciting. Oh, oh is that a military? Yes, it is. There's usually good loot in there, but they also tend to have mines uh -oh. on the edges. So we want to be careful around those. Actually, that one might not. There's outposts, too. Those usually have the mines. That one's more like a normal base, I guess. But good to know this is here. Should be good loot. Actually, yeah. Oh, I'm going backwards. This is awkward. Okay, let's go. Oh no. Oh, that's. <laughs> what was that? I didn't know I had a horn. Oh, you hear the mines going off? That's a lot of birds. Yep, they're coming at me. There's four of them! Get away! Your friends are dead. Jeez. What was over there? You usually only see that many in a desert. Might as well get the feathers and bones from them. You can't actually use the rotten meat to make fertile soil. Go figure. Alright. Jeez. Well, that was an unexpected detour. Anyway. I should make it back in time. How close it'll be, I have no idea. 
I might have something good in it. Yeah. Look at that. There's more over there. It must have increased his spawn rates in the forest areas. Because otherwise you usually only see him on the roofs if there's a nest up there, like uh, last episode. Or in the deserts, or on the blood moons, there'll probably be a few. I remember right too, a while ago they actually had giant bees that attacked too, like way back, but I guess they removed those. Oh, come on. That's right. They're all over the place. I wonder if it's because it's the blood moon. Maybe that's why there's more. Now to avoid them accidentally destroying this, I'm going to have to park this a bit away from the building. And sometimes in trying to get to you, they destroy anything in the way, and that includes like workbenches, mini bikes. At least that's how it used to be. Maybe they programmed them to go around those things. Almost there. Get us a rock real quick. Might need the materials. Get as much as we can. Trying to walk around that. <clears throat> All right, let's go. Almost there, we'll have some time. Oh! Oh, there's a rock there. Alright, what I'll try to do, like I said, I don't want him accidentally destroying this, so I'll park this here. That's, that's the storm. Make sure this is topped off. Goes in there. All right. Wait, did they spawn in here? Sometimes they do that. I think he sees me. If I shoot his eye out, that'll be a no. 
Well, that was an unintentional headshot, but I'll take it. Alright, that's my plan. Try to keep him from getting up here. Oh, they might get on that, though. Why? Oh, okay, I see. It's one of them toppers. So we'll just go ahead and put that there anyway. Don't want that being an access point. Like I said, my goal is to kind of hold up here, but if they get here, they might actually get up to... So... Because they can stack on top of each other sometimes. You know what I could do? I don't know if I should do. Let's try it. Uh, where's the catwalks? Let's see, can I do this? Is that rain or did I just wet myself? I can run over to here, destroy these. Almost there. I should have an extra one of these to place here. What I'll do is I don't want them following me across. So I'll try to get these so I can pop them almost immediately if need be. Probably do one more. Let me test that. Yes, I can. That should be enough. Hopefully they don't destroy any of this stuff. Oh, that's right, I put all that in the top thing. I was wondering where all my explosives were. Take two. Really need that.
I already got a flashlight. Doesn't. <gasps> All right, I'll take that just in case I need it. I got more of that actually. Scrap that. That in there. Medical stuff. Take a full stack. to die. Actually, take this. Pair that. Make sure everything's good to go. survive this or not, we'll find out soon. Another one of these real quick. You have too much weight it slows you down drains your stamina faster so I'm trying to get that cleared out All right I don't remember if these act as distractions too I don't think they do like I said we'll find out all right Probably do one more. Hey. Can't. Good. About to happen. If you don't upgrade it, you can pick it, re pick it up. <laughs> That's nice. All right, they'll probably spawn outside, but if you're far enough away, they will spawn inside the barrier. Yep, like that.
he's doing that thing. <laughs> well, this is a great start. Alright, that's just annoying. One's up here. See, they do stack on each other. I don't know if that's on purpose or what, but they can. I don't know how I keep missing them. <gasps> as big a target as there. I'm panic firing but I like somehow I'm not precise enough to hit or accurate enough to hit them but I'm precise enough I could shoot in between the gaps between them <laughs> a little bit frustrating that looked like that should have been a hit like that was just over his shoulder Right in the fourth vertebrae. This isn't too bad. Of course, it is the first blood moon. Actually, I should keep an eye out for vultures. Sometimes they pop up. Also, gotta be careful I don't accidentally jump off. Got till uh, 4 a.m. So, gotta be careful I don't destroy the loot bag. Sometimes there's good stuff in there. Just for fun. Oh wait, do you have to light this? There you go. I missed. How about that one? Oh, that set off the other one. Alright, I should not let them get through over here. I'm so bad at point blank shotting. I'm good at being stealthy, but... Eh. Let's hope a cop zombie doesn't show up. They spit acid. Literally. Because she went to the fire. Oh, get down from there. That's not safe. Crazy kids. The next wave. 
That is a good thing about this structure is the steel fence is pretty tough. Oh, I thought that despawned. Oh! Not good! See, they must have stacked up over here. Eh. She got up somehow. They did it when I wasn't looking. Oh, there it is. There they were. All right, they're starting to pour it through. <laughs> Got it. I don't know where they're getting up, but they're getting up. Sneaky vultures. Probably didn't need to retreat that fast, but I'm out of arrows, so... Can this get them through there? Yes, it can. That was a bad throw. Hey, hey, hey. Is that a rabbit? Is that a zombie rabbit? Well, it's double dead now. I don't know where that thing came from. I shouldn't waste all my Molotovs. Actually, can I make more arrows? Yeah. I put all my stone in the thing. Do so you know I'm gonna go get that? Nice quiet night of horror. There, uh, I put the stone away, didn't I? Did I? I know I had rocks on me. What did I do with them? I must have put them in the one downstairs. Oh well. I thought I had rocks on me. Let's see, there's gotta be rocks in here somewhere. There they are. Oh, sounds like they breached it somewhere. Yeah, those are tougher than I thought they would be. Of course, this is only the first blood moon, so. Oh, yep, they're right. I can hear. They only jump when you don't look. <laughs> oh, where'd he go? Oh, he didn't get in there already. They better not be destroying my stuff. Keep an eye out for the vultures. It is set so there can only be so many per player on a blood moon, so I don't get like crazy overwhelmed. 
Because trust me, if they breach those walls, I'm in a lot of trouble. And I wasn't up here, hiding. Like a coward. But they're zombies, come on. Pretty sure I can't shoot through that anyway. They have more... I put those away. I don't know. I was going to try to jump to that. <laughs> Get myself killed. kept coming up on this side, so I don't know. Maybe they're coming up through the hole? Oh! There it was. Nice try. You know what? You can damage structures with your stuff too, so... It's one of the reasons I'm not using the explosives too much. That might be it, actually. That wasn't too bad. I thought it might have been a bit worse. That or there's more spawning and I don't see them yet. Oh, come on. Step back right when I fired. I thought I reloaded. I think that's the last one. Make our rounds on the wall. I think we're good. Nice. Watch as soon as I jump down, there's going to be a ton more. Man, those used to usually have pretty good loot in them consistently. I guess they changed that too. Alright. Let's start packing a move to the new... That's kind of cool. Like a color scheme. Get packed to the go to the new place. You can actually... Get the stuff you put in here back out, which is nice. So, alright. Going the wrong way. Ah, uh, I do need these. Yeah, uh, nope. 
messed that up. Let's see. Ah. Oh. All right. We're gonna. Do this the right way then. There we go. these for now because we don't need them right away much as I want to take them survived <gasps> eh. it's moving day now after death day of course Just grabbing what I can take Oh, I thought I had some of this left over. All right. We survived. There's no stop button, there's just forward and backward. All right, put what we can in here. Oh, there's some of that in there. I didn't put that in. I might have had a full stack, though. Yeah, I don't really need these. A lot of them are backup stuff. I could always come back for them later. Please, those would be useful. Actually, what we could do sell some of that back to that lady.
I will survive. You're not dead. Yeah, that was a full stack. Don't really need that, but what? Alright, let's go. Gotta make the most of the time we got. Did I close the door? Oh well, we'll find out when I get back. Actually, I think too, I was thinking of building a crossbow before. I think you actually need bow crossbow parts. But you don't get bow parts from the primitive bow, it has to be a wooden bow. So I actually can't make that until I find the specific weapon parts for it, which I'm sure I'll find eventually. So I might be better off just buying the crossbow she had. Oh, okay, she's not open yet. That's the problem. I that's weird that it does that though. Oh, that's right. Cuz when you're if you're in there when the they close, they teleport you outside. So I guess when you try to get in while they're still closed, it just teleports you. I think they open at 6, 7, 8. Well, this is awkward. It's just Hide here for a second. If they don't open at six, we'll head over to the base, the new one. Any second now. Maybe. I think different traders open at different times too. What? <laughs> I know that used to be they would it would make like a sound like eh the trader is now open. Trader Jones is now open. They open at six oh five apparently. Keep using some alien technology to teleport me around because they don't want a good paying customer. So, what are you buying today? Everything. That might be worth it. But let's see, what do we got to sell? Sell that, sell Is this valuable? But oh, that, that's valuable. There. We'll keep the rest for now. Do you have to have the parts day. for a wooden bow? I'm glad I could help you. Wooden bow. Yeah, you still need the parts. So. Yeah. I think I'm going to go ahead and buy that. Because why not? Of course, there's a the shotgun. See, I'm already getting distracted. That's the one thing I don't like, too. Even though this is technically a better item. For some reason, this has better stats, I guess. That's 2438. Or no, it doesn't. Alright, I always get confused if the negative numbers are for what I'm comparing it to or the. Anyway. We'll go ahead and buy that. Well, you just brightened my day. I'm glad I could help you. Well, thank you. I'm pretty much out of arrows for that anyway. I don't know if this can go with the crossbow. Oh, I can. All right. But I don't have any ammo for it with me. Oh, it can shoot wooden arrows. I didn't know that. Right? It's 
stone crossbow bolt. Wait. Where did I find those? Stone arrow, stone crossbow, bull. Huh. So apparently I had just one of those on me. Or it probably came with it, actually. Anyway, I'm getting distracted, so we're gonna head back to the new place. Let's see. It's way over here. So if we just head south and follow the road, we should be get there quickly. Actually, do I have... No, I don't. Or it's on the bike. Never mind. Yep, yeah, okay. Road trip. not so bad when there aren't evil demon-like creatures trying to kill you. Yeah, I know they're zombies, but things are pretty evil looking. And that's why you don't stand in the middle of the road, kids. Not that anyone should do that, but... It is rude for both parties to do either one of those things. See, they look left, but not right. Look both ways. Plus, I think I'm saving time. I'm on the road. I'm going faster because I'm not hitting all the bumps on the hills. Well, first Blood Moon wasn't too bad. That's good. It probably would have been worse if I was in any other structure. It's those steel and brick walls that protected me. Or kept them from getting in. Only problem is sometimes they end up stacking and climbing over. I was getting a drink of water there. <laughs> Like, I should be fine. Oh, there's a rock on the other side of that. Go back on vacation. Get some experience on the way. Alright. 
Oh, almost made the gap. Then we Austin powered it. should do make a storage chest I like organizing my stuff if I can so I'll end up putting a bunch of different chests down to better keep track of them sometimes they're in the rafters we look good all right Oh, they had a thing in here. All right. So we'll keep these. So this usually doesn't have much room, so I might get rid of this. Ooh, that's going to be good. Iron fire axe. That's got plenty. Oh, a lot of nice stuff in here. I won't use that. This would be good if I didn't have this. Anyway, let's see. That did. This, this will be my weapon box for now. Weapon and ammo. Those in. I don't have ammo, so I might as well leave this here. Not expecting much trouble. It'll be my uh, general resource box. Put this on here. This will be better for trees and stuff. The stone axe is just a general purpose kind of tool. This, what, how did I used to do it? I did it a certain way. Because you end up getting a ton of stuff, but for now we'll put all the food in here. That's grain alcohol, that's for medical stuff. Because eventually you get so much I made a separate box for like prepared food and whatnot. Like the base ingredient. Oops. That there, that'll be my medical stuff. This will be kind of miscellaneous for now. Put that in there. All right. Keep these. Let's go. Clear this up a bit. I'll loot this stuff later. Alright. Okay, let's go. Already getting distracted. Wanna loot everything. Should only have to do one more trip, then we'll be back on track. Or start building the base, reinforcing, explore a bit around, check out the new neighborhood. Oh, 
Oh, you know what? I forgot something important. As I always do. Until the last second. Forgot I had a bunch of stuff on the bike I want to drop off too. I always do that. It's like, hmm, this is important and I should remember to do it when I have the opportunity. Then after the opportunity passes, hmm, I probably should have done that. Like it literally doesn't enter my brain sometimes. It's like, oh, we should do this. And then my brain's like, hey, that's what you think. Because it's my brain, it does the thinking. Actually, I should have just done that. Fill this back up. Okay, let's see. What was I going to do with that? Yeah. Medical. Ah, oh, should be fine. But I'll take two of those just in case. I'm putting these back on the bike because it's good to have if you're trying to loot stuff and your tool needs repaired. Pull that off the bike. All right, we should be good now. All right, now we can go back. This will probably be the next five minutes. Or 10. Maybe 20, I don't know. Oh, it's a deer. I don't have my bow and arrow. Got good hide on it. Oh, yes. No, no, you were trapped. <laughs> Got it. This is my deer. Get good meat and hide off of this. Oh, is this a deer or a caribou? More like caradette. That zombie's name was Kara. Anyway. Yeah, according to the lore in this game, and I say lore lightly, the zombies are caused by like a kind of weird fluish virus. So it's not like a spiritual kind of zombie thing or uh, supernatural I should say by lore I mean these not much but it's something I'm glad we finally found that base. Like I said, it's a good structure to look for. It's basically a pre-built little fort. You gotta reinforce it and everything, but... No matter I first played that, I was playing with uh, my brother and we found that. He actually found it. And I'm like, oh, that's pretty good. And I played a different game and I found one in the desert near the start. I just start reinforcing the walls. It's a good, good base, or a good starter base, I should say. That's if you want it pre-built and all that, for the most part. Oh, I'll drop it right here. Yep, we're going for that. Off-road to victory or treasure, whatever. 
Actually, we're gonna have to wait for it to drop. So, uh, take our time. 